Why am I doing Plants vs. Zombies two days in a row? I don't know. Free will, I guess. So, as I was watching the video yesterday, uh, a couple of ideas crossed my mind. And I would like to share those with you now. And hopefully we get this on the first try, because I can't have two videos of myself. Anyway. <laughs> it's a little bit cheaper than the repeater slash stump. But not only well, repeater slash stump is 375, this is 300. Uh, but the other thing about this is that it actually covers two rows, not just one. But we have to be careful how we use it. Keep TSPPs around just in case, but... I think this is gonna have to be our play! <laughs> That's two yawns and we haven't even started the level yet, dude. Yeah, what am I forgetting here? Go ahead and tell me. Because you know it's something, you know there's something there that you forgot. What? The other idea I had was similar to this, but using these in excess. I don't know how well that would really work, but like... Like, I guess if you trapped them in the right spot, you could get a few extra shots on them. Dumping and chunking and every single day, here comes the garlic. Better put it down, 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 down. This is not commentary, all I'm doing is saying the word down over and over again. What can you do about that? I really don't want to know because I'm scared that you'll tell me you won't be my friend. I don't know how this cone head's gonna work out, but uh. Well, let's wait and see here. I wanna at least get the stars filled up first before I start with the mushroom. At least that way we can kinda see where we're at with things. Well, really, there's no guarantees in the long run, but. Yeah, we gotta do something here. Ah. Even if you're stalling them for seemingly no reason. There's never no reason to stall a zombie, though, that's the thing. Yeah, I think we're ready to go ahead and start setting this up here. Yeah, especially if we're gonna be seeing a bucket head. Oh, I don't believe it. I guess I'm full of shit. Let him go. Stay on the leader. Oh, hey, oh, we'll get some damage in here. A little bit before they eat the garlic. Yeah, that upgrade to the mushrooms is going to be a little costly. But I'm pretty sure it'll be worth the time. We will have to stay on top of that garlic, though. Do -do 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 -do. It's just a waiting game at this point. Okay, here we go. Alright, this is done. Now, let the real pain begin, Danny boy. So now comes the point where we're going to want to start working on garlic for top and bottom rows. Because we still want to do that. We're going to need to slow this guy down here. We've had too many instances of bucket heads just getting through. Wow on account of either just getting lucky or happening to have zombies in front of them. Could be a number of different things, really. But, uh, yeah, so, well... Mushroom's doing good work over here. I'm just saving up my son until... the rightful moment here. I can use these instead of TSPPs, then I'd rather do that. I think I might have to use a squash here. Jeez. Alright. Let's 
keep those busy for a minute here. Alright, Garlic goes there. Mushy goes there. Mushy! Yeah, look at the way he's tearing up those bucket heads. This guy's eyes are already popping out. Popping out of his head. Yeah, if we can go ahead and start getting these guys up into row four and two, that would be a huge help. This garlic's about need about ready for a replacement here, so let's just keep this guy busy so that the stars can take him out, and then we'll work, you know, figure out stuff from there. All right, he lost his bucket, which is good. Keep an eye on that garlic. I mean, it's pretty much guaranteed we're going to need to replace the garlic before we put out the next star. Right? I just want to get as much out of it as I can. I think this will probably work, but uh, I just don't want to count my chickens before they hatch here. It's not dead yet. See, now everything's getting rounded into the mushroom's wake. And that's good. There it is. Oh, just in time, dude. Alright, now time to start planting some behind these garlics here. And the rest should be pretty much cake. Hopefully. I mean, there's still the issue of getting the rest of them out, but, you know. Yeah, look at that. That's so good. So much damage there. So much good, healthy damage. I'm going to go ahead and start working on row two next here. Because I feel like this will be more manageable. the one two three drum thing in the background See, that mushroom's hitting every single zombie there too which is why I said this was a good idea this may end up being like a recurring idea oh uh, yeah I'm starting to lose the garlic up here on top over here just watch it very closely And the more time we can keep him in range of that mushroom, the better, man. Especially now that we have a star behind it. We have children to protect here now. It's probably like every chance we get, we should be putting these puff shrooms in here. Alright, we got massive firepower going on now. This is good. We gotta keep these guys busy, though. Very, very good. Very good. Uh oh, we lost the. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. I can't put the garlic here. Um. Wait, well, let's just see what happens here. Might, okay, we didn't need to squash them. Hell yeah. Uh oh, we need garlic down here. Alright, that's fine. We're gonna need garlic in the middle too pretty soon, so. Start planting those stars just yet. This is fine. We're in between waves. It's the calm before the storm, y'all. Oh hell, I need a star right there too. Oh, I forgot about that. This is dangerous. this garlic here. Yeah, 
Yep, we're good. We're good. Here comes the second half of that wave now. No, 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 Garlic's doing. Ah, uh, the one on row one just died, okay. This is okay, like, we're saving up sun right now. Oh, jeez, the one in the middle is almost gone again. The one on the bottom's dead. Shit. This is, uh. I don't know. Oh, uh, the one in the middle died again? Thank God. Alright, I don't have time to think about money right now. Jeez Louise. It would be funny if somebody was saying it to their screen right before I said that. Alright, how are the garlics doing? Who needs replacing now? here. And up top. Jeez. Alright, alright. Maybe we'll let the top ones go. Because that's only one star, but still. Shit, man. Damn it, I just replaced that one. Shit. Well, now we're dead. No, we have to do this faster than this. I don't believe this. Yeah, restart. Restart the level. Oh, this wouldn't be so bad if it didn't take 20 minutes for every attempt. They're pretty close here, y'all. I don't know, man. Oh, thank goodness that garlic hasn't run out yet. Uh, who's closest in here? That guy can just run on through if he wants. Oh, oh, oh. What about that one right there? The stars are actually doing all the defending. There, there, did it. Oh, my gosh. Oh, wow. We did it. That's what it's about right there. I planted that by mistake. Because I panicked and thought a buckethead was going to get through. But it ended up that the stars, once you had them out there, did enough damage to kind of make it so you didn't have to use all the other stuff. And that ended up being the key to winning it right there. You just have to do it quickly before the worst waves start to set in. That's all there really is to it. So, what do we got here? Click on tank to feed zombies. 
Good lord. Oh, I guess. Brains. There, have some brains, y'all. <laughs> Let's just put some more out here. Well, they're not really hungry, so those are probably gonna rot. Plus, they're also rich in cholesterol. This might be just the most boring minigame of them all, though. Could buy more snorkel zombies. How many would I have to buy to maximize my speed run here? Because you basically got unlimited brains, right? Is this sort of like Link's Awakening fishing or something? I mean, don't ask me, I don't know. I always said that fishing was boring when I was a kid. But I just didn't have any appreciation for the atmosphere and all that. You definitely make sun faster the more zombies you have, don't you? It's like an incremental process, sort of. It's like you start with two, then you got four, then you got eight, then you got, what, like, 16, and then 32, and then 64. And then 128, and then, jeez Louise. Whoa, 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 we got some Starvers here. Starvers, not Starburst. What happens if you let one die? I guess you just lose the zombie then. So you can only have like so many brains on the screen at one time though. That's the tricky part. I'm gonna try to keep brains within eating distance there. I think this is probably enough zombies right here. I should be able to get it within. Oh my god, this is so boring. Well, if it's boring, then let's talk about something. How's everybody doing? Today is December 8th, 2019. That's a glorious day. Happy birthday to Sarah Bear and uh, Judy Bug yesterday. There you go, we did it. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. So that was actually super easy, when you big old twist. Oh yeah, I remember this one. This is that one that I just couldn't wrap my mind around it though. Cause like, you have to twist them rather than... So they twist like counterclockwise, sort of like that. Like that. And then if you see a match that you think you can make, you just have to figure out how to do it. It's tricky though. How do I get this? There we go. I was like, how do I get these in here? Wait, no, right there. Okay. Um, that right there. Oops, no, backwards. Wait, wait, no. Okay, that's, that's even better. That's five in a row right there. Damn, when you're good, you're good, aren't you? These up. Oh, what's, well, I didn't mean to do that. Jeez. Oh, wait. Oh, right there. There we go. You kind of just have to wrap your head around it a little bit. Except that's not as easy to do as you might think, though. Oh, there we go. Um, sure. Oops. No, that was to the right. That's what we're trying to do. These to the left. We can't do that though. Can't do that though. Sure. Oh my god! I can't believe there's not like more, like another version of. There probably is another version of this game somewhere in the world. Out there. Oh, let's see. They ain't gonna like plants. Well, refill that and turn those into those. Almost better to just randomly click and hope you get something. That might be what we have to do here. Oh man, December 8th though. 
feel like there's something about December 8th. That date resonates with me for some strange reason. Can't quite put my finger on it. Probably had a tape on that day or something. Jeez, what the hell happened there? I didn't see it, but I sure do love it. Ah, uh, how do I do uh, there? Oh, thank you, Mr. Magnet. That was very helpful. Wait, I see one. Here we go. I didn't see what I matched there. Or there. No, I saw that one. Yeah. I saw that one. Ba Bob saw that one there. <laughs> I don't mean to keep making references to that, that's so dumb. These magnets are a lifesaver, though. Uh, I can't believe I can't do anything with any of these. What? Oh, okay. Thanks for the heads up there. Uh, 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 uh. I don't know what to say. This is too much action for one person, man, let me tell you. How far are we from, like, the trophy here? Get that. What is the objective here, anyway? Oh, 75 matches. Well, shoot, man. We're almost there. 75 matches. So, oh, goody. Five matches to go. Well, I don't know if that's worth $5, but it's definitely a shake. I misquoted Pulp Fiction. Should we put to the guillotine for that? Oh, sure, yeah, I'll do that. Ah, uh, I don't see a match here. Oh, alright. Something up front, apparently. There it is, we did it! Oh, sorry about the lack of commentary there, jeez. You'd think on Sunday we would do better than this, but... Well, there you have it. So, I appreciate y'all hanging out with me here today, even if we didn't say much. Sometimes just hanging out with a relative silence is good, too. You know what I mean, I hope. Anyway, see you guys next time. Goodbye. So happy. <laughs> like, what are you so happy about? I don't know anymore.